All right, so in this video, I'll be going through worksheet number two, part number 10. Uh, the easiest way to draw part number 10 is to create this right side view, right? If I can simply create this right side view and extrude it my five inches, I would have my completed part, right? So there's nothing to draw in this document. Uh, for this part, I'm gonna start by going from this point here down by two and a half inches. Then it goes to the left by three fourths or 0.75. So I'm gonna click create, document. This was part 10. Again, I'm gonna click sketch, front view, giving me that sketch plane. Left hand side, I'm just gonna click these three eyes off so that those view planes are not there anymore line tool from that start point right there, that center point, it goes down, we said 2.5 or 2.5, then it goes to the left, 0.75, this point here goes up half an inch or 0.5, you can type it in as a fraction, it'll work the same, it goes to the left, 0.75, This distance here, right, so if this is two and a half, this line has to be two inches. Right? We've got a half inch here, here's our other two inches. I go up, type in two. Now it goes to the left, goes to the left, my half an inch, and then down one inch. Goes to the right, 0.5, up my one inch again, and then back to my start. Again, there I've got my grayed out object. I'm gonna hit my green check to finish my sketch. I'm gonna go to isometric, extrude, click on my part. Because we drew our right side view now, we drew this side, my distance here is five. And there is part number 10 on worksheet number two. Thank you.